We've finally made it overseas to England. back with another vlog so right now i'm over here at the car vault of javora hotel to take a look at a very special car and that is this supra right here this my friends is the exact same toyota supra which was once owned by smoky nagata and yes this is the exact same car which got him banned from london in november 4th 1998 all of these cars which you guys see over here are owned by a guy named dubai 39 and yes he is the founder of the world's famous supercar the devil system i mean it's not even a supercar it's more of like a hypercar it produces around 5000 horsepower it's not into production yet and i feel like it will come out in 2025 but anyway all of these cars which you see over here are owned by Dubai 39. So anyway, let's start with the first car. This, my friends, is the exact same car which was used in the 1989 Batman movie. And yes, it's the exact same car. It's not a replica. It's a movie prop car, if you know what I mean. Just take a look at this car. And to be honest, it's the first time I'm seeing a Dubai car with a number plate on it. I mean, a Batmobile with Dubai number plate on it. And it looks insane. That was our Batmobile. So anyway, let me know in the comments below what do you guys think about this car right here. So up next, we have this Formula 1 car from the 90s. And it's beautiful. It's more of like a collector's item. Up next, we have this classic Chevrolet Corvette. And over here, we have a Mitsubishi GTO. And I feel like this owner is a diehard fan of JDM cars. Like, they they have a lot of wins in JDM cars to start off. So this is where we are starting off. And up next, we have a Porsche 944 Turbo. And fun fact, I have seen a lot of abandoned Porsche 944s over here in Dubai. Like literally, I have seen a couple of cars like right next to dustbins and stuff like that. So anyway, we have a 944. And to be honest, this is my first time seeing a Lamborghini Diablo over here in Dubai. And it's in pristine condition. Just take a look at this thing. You can see the Lamborghini logo. So up next, we have the classic dodge viper v10 it's a gts model if i'm not mistaken yes it's a gts just take a look at the specs and you guys have to take a look at the number plates the number plates are actually pretty unique it's f2334 and up next we have a porsche and to be honest i'm not a huge porsche consumer so i feel like this is a very special porsche so let me know in the comments below what porsche do you think this is up next we have another jdm legend we have a subaru wrx sti it's fully tuned if i'm not mistaken just take a look at the design the way how we keeps this car is actually insane you can see the subaru technica international logo and it looks insane man so <laughs> ah it's one clean car so up next this is the moment you go hold i've been waiting for this my friends was the exact same car which was used by Smokey nagata london motorway he was actually trying to hit 200 miles per hour but he was only able to clock in about 197 miles per hour and it looks beautiful if you're talking about the power figures and stuff like that, back in 1998 when Smokey was doing the top speed run, this car had an RB26 engine instead of a 2JC and it produced around 1000 horsepower and about 680 pound feet of torque. Later in 2008, they did an engine swap by adding a V12 engine from a Toyota Century in this very Supra right here. But right now, this car is sitting with an RB26 engine. They have completely stripped this car out to make it lightweight. I'm not sure if you guys can see. Back then, this car had a lot of stickers, but right now it's completely removed, and I don't know why, but it looks insane. Though. I mean, this car carries an history with it. Just when Smokey was satisfied with his run, he gets some company. Oh no, the British cops try to catch up with their go karts. Here is never before seen footage of the police busting someone after performing the world's fastest public highway blast. Where's the video time? Video time, where? What? What? Where is the video tape? Video? Oh, uh, I speak uh, English. Right. I speak English. Do you think this is a bloody playground? It only sucks what? if you get caught. What? Do you think this is a playground? Uh, no, I understand that. No, I'm sure you don't. Sit, sit, uh, uh, sit, 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 Smokey sit, can uh, hardly understand yes, English, video. yet we oh, no, no, can no. hardly understand sit, their sit. British accent. <laughs> This car is the main reason I feel like why Top Secret actually got us win. So anyway, up next we have this Acura NSX in black color. And me personally, I'm a huge fan of this car because 
it comes with this retro vibe to it if you know what i mean and over here we have a evo 5 and as i said the owner of this car collection is a huge fan of jdm cars over here we have a classic ferrari let me know in the comments below what ferrari do you guys think this is and over here we have a nissan gtr r34 v spec 2 and this car has seen better days if i'm not mistaken the headlights is pretty crash it recently got into a car crash if i'm not mistaken but it looks beautiful okay so this block is dedicated for american muscle over here we have a 1970s dot challenger rt this my friends is a classic chevrolet camaro we have three ford mustang this is a mark one this is also a mark one but just take a look at the tire of that thing it's completely burst out i have no clue why and over here we have a mustang bose 302 and over here we have a buick we have a chevrolet impala and i have no clue what chevrolet this is so let me know in the comments below what do you guys think this is and over here we have a pontiac gto the exact same charger which is on by dom toreto in fast and furious and to be honest this is the first time i'm seeing this car in person so let me know what do you guys think about this beast right here and also comment down below what do you guys think this entire car collection is worth because me personally i feel like it's well over 10 million dollars if i'm not mistaken but i might be wrong so anyway we have this classic maserati over here we have the citron and this my friends is actually a lamborghini espada to be honest i had zero knowledge about this car i recently came to know about this just because stratman bought it so that's why i know this car so it's a lamborghini espada over here we have an aston martin it's a classic aston martin and i have no clue what lamborghini this is so comment down below what do you guys think this lamborghini is and just take a look at this thing only in dubai you'll see something like this just take a look at this thing right here this my friends is a lifted rolls royce silver shadow only in dubai you'll see something like this just take a look at this thing let me know in the comments below what do you guys think about this beast right here and over here we have a classic maserati all right guys so these are the cars which they have on this floor over here we have a classic ferrari we have a mercedes and fun fact they have a lot of classic mercedes and to be honest i have zero knowledge about these cars over here so let me know in the comments below what do you guys think about this mercedes right here and we have a classic lincoln and this my friends is a classic evo 7 if i'm not missing it's a evo 7 or evo 8 let me know that as well and just take a look at this thing it's a, it's a bmw race car so let me know what do you guys think about this beast right here and fun fact it doesn't come with a seat oh seat is there but it's like pretty plus 10 if you know what i mean and over here we have a g63 and i have zero clue why a mitsubishi pajero coupe is over here so let me know about that as well we have a classic pontiac trans am we have a ford expedition i don't know why and we have a lot of mercedes and that my friends is a nissan patrol y60 we have another car over here we have a bmw z8 no it's not a bmw z8 it's uh, it's a classic BMW 850 if I'm not missing it, so let me know about that as well. So anyway guys, that was the car collection which they had over here at Jawara Hotel. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So if you guys want more videos like this, then make sure to subscribe with the like button and share this video. Till then, it's Jawara signing off.